Hey, it's one of your comic book readers out there, Mike from Comic Frontline here, and welcome to our comic review from DC Comics, He-Man The Attorney War, issue number 12. And things have been getting very, very dicey, and it gets even more dicey as the issue continues, and that's what I really like about uh, the uh, He-Man The Attorney War comic books that I keep getting uh, each and every month, and... A lot of stuff happens here where uh, we have uh, Skeletor who makes his own weapon out of uh, Hordok's Dark Blade and uh, the staff and everything is going to play a huge role uh, in this issue. And we also get a lot of uh, Prince Adam moments uh, like 12 <coughs> years earlier where, uh, well I'll give you guys some artwork right here which is drawn really nice, where uh, uh, Lord Hiss has like uh, Prince Adam's uh, memories of uh, all the people that he uh, knew in the past and um, basically every memory he cherished so to say and there's one part of the book where get ready for this one he is back as He-Man like he is no longer the Prince Adam he just went He-Man and that's what made me smile just seeing him back in his He-Man form <coughs> Uh, going after uh, Lord Hiss. Meanwhile, we have Balgat and Tila, not uh, the other Tila, like the regular Tila. But then, of course, there's um, the other Tila, who we known as uh, the uh, Guardian or or something like that. And um, what Tila actually explains to him uh, are basically the key moments in his life that made him worthy of holding the He-Man powers, thus why he became He-Man once again. And there's going to be a keystone that he has that uh, will protect the memories at all costs, but it must not fall. And when he fights with Lord Hiss, well, here's a spoiler alert. It falls, but we won't know what will happen next because that will be to be continued until the next He-Man comic book. So... I have got to find out what happens after that because that's going to play a huge role along with Skeletor of what he's going to do with the uh, new weaponry with Hordok's Dark Blood. But this comic book, guys, is a mixed range between a 4 to 4.5 out of 5. Excellent artwork and a really pickup story and it is getting really chaotic. He-Man's back, everybody. If you guys want to see He-Man... This is the comic book he's in, and it is great to see him back because he holds the true worthy powers of He-Man. And there are a bunch of other stuff that I did leave out that I want you guys to definitely check it out if and if you want to pick up this comic book. It is a recommendation, though. Uh, with that, everybody, that is my comic review of He-Man The Attorney War, issue number 12. Don't forget to check out comicfrontline.com, zonefullpodcast.com. And our YouTube channel, Frontline Gaming Zone, because we are, you know, one source for comic and game related news reviews and a whole bunch more. Hit that subscribe button to Comic Frontline today for more stuff to come your way. And your support means the world to us as always. And leave your comments below, your thoughts, likes, dislikes, or any questions you have to, that you want to ask me about this comic book. Let me know and I'll try to get back to you guys as soon as I can. And to all you comic book readers out there, I'm Mike from Comic Frontline saying take care and don't forget to keep watching. Later, everybody.